What's up ladies and gentlemen, I'm Laughing Coyote, this is Cricket19 Tutorial. I am going to show you how to get the uh, Asia 11 and the Legends 11 and all that teams, you know. If you've downloaded this game for free, in other words, you've pirated this game, you can't do this. It's simple as that. It's not going to work. Stop wasting your time. Stop asking me how to do it. It's not going to work. You have an illegal copy of the game, so stop, all right? If you bought it legally, then it will work. If you did not buy it legally, it will not work. Simple as that. All right, now let's move on. So you start the game. Here's where you are. You move over, uh, go to Cricket Academy. Then you move over, as you can see on the top left side, it says designer, creator on and community. You move over to community. Now, the way you move over is you press RB, I think it is. Yeah, RB on Xbox and R1 on PlayStation. And I have no clue what you do on PC because I don't play on PC. But you move over to that. Um, already uploaded these teams to make it easy for you. Uh, the way I made them, I went to players and I did it individually, but I made it easier for you guys. You can just go to teams and uh, go to gamer tag if you have a playstation or a pc it might say id or username so just go to that and enter my name which is laughing coyote and um, you don't even have to enter my whole uh, name just do laughing c o y and i think that's enough you know and uh, just a search i have a lot of teams so when you search for my name you will not just find these legends in asia and all these teams you'll find pretty much all the teams I have as you can see there you go there's so many teams right um, but yeah so you can get any of these teams but if you're looking for the Asia or whatever you just go down and you know you keep going down and it'll load more as you see it might take a little while to load uh, because like I said there are so many teams I have um, but uh, where is it? it's still not okay yeah, you just keep going uh, down. Uh, also, if your uh, academy says uh, service out or something like that, try again later. Uh, just try again later. That's what that means. It means the servers are down. Either your internet is bad or the uh, uh, servers for b the big ant servers are down. So there's nothing I can do about that. There's nothing you can do about that. All you can do is just wait, try it the next day uh, or something like that. Uh, if it says parental, something about parental controls, there again, I cannot help you. That's a problem you have with, oh, there we go, Asian Legends. But yeah, if you get that message, then you have to go into your, if you're playing on PlayStation, then your PlayStation network settings and change those settings. Or if you're doing it on Xbox, I don't think on Xbox, you guys will have this problem. PlayStation seems to have a lot of those problems. Uh, so yeah, Asia Legends, and you can just hit Y on Xbox or Triangle and it'll download it. Uh, but you can also go in, select the team and you know check if it is the right team as you can see there you go you will see the kits and all the players i have in there um you know wasima Krim and all that um yeah so the, uh, you download those and then the world legends is right here you download those uh, i already have them well i made these teams obviously i have them that's why i'm not downloading them um oh by the way uh i should have separated these teams uh but you know uh as you can see look it it has the current players as well. So I uploaded them together, not separately. Now that I think about it, some of you will have trouble uh, separating the players. So let me just quickly show you how to separate them actually. So when you download both of these, you'll have uh, all the players. Oh, by the way, if you wanna change any of the players, you can do that as well. But let me quickly show you that. So you go over to creator, go to team uh, creator, and you just go to manage mail teams. These teams, because they're not like real teams, they'll go to custom, as you can see right here. So I have separated them already. Actually, you know what? Let me just quickly share these teams uh, as well. So uh, it's easy for you guys. There you go. So I'm just going to, there you go. As you can see, I'm sharing these uh, teams as well. So you don't even have to do that. But I will still show you just in case you want to um, make your own team. So there you go. Let me share this one as well. And uh, share so uh, yeah there you have it now you have by the time this video goes up these teams will be up as well so you can then download those four teams but in case these teams aren't showing up since i just uploaded them or something like that what you can do is just go to the team go to manage squad and here y or triangle and add or remove players so you can remove the old players from the current team and add the newer players you just search for like uh you know 
anyone. Like, here we go. You got uh, Shakib al Hassan. You want to add him to the current Asia 11 team? Just select him, you know, and there you go. Um, just like that. It's so simple, you know. And again, if you want to remove someone, like, say this was the current Asia team and it has legends, so you just, again, Y and you hit remove and it'll remove that player. So it's that simple. Also, if you want to go a step further and uh, edit some of these players, uh, their skills and all that, you can go to player, uh, let me go slowly. So you back out of that, you go to player creator and you go to manage male players. And uh, here are all the players. So you just select any of them. Oops, sorry, I just punched my mic. <laughs> uh, you can change their names, date of births, all of that crap. And here you can actually, actually you can just add them from, uh, again, I hit the mic, man. I need to stop doing that. Uh, anyways, um, so you can just add them to any team really, any team you want. Oh, I have these teams as well. I should probably just upload these as well. You know what? I'm gonna upload those as well. But yeah, from here you can change. Let me just quickly go through this well. Yeah, appearance, personality, you know, left hand baller and all that. Skills, equipment, if you want to give them like a real bat. I didn't give them a real bat because, well, they don't play in real life, so I don't know which bat they'll have. You can change their stats and stuff as well. But yeah, let me actually quickly upload these other teams I have as well. It's Pakistan, all time india all time it's the quad nations cup uh it'll start very soon uh so yeah australia all time oh by the way i made my own don bradman because don bradman was not available to me for some reason on the academy so yeah i um um made my own don bradman so he's in there as well so that's brilliant um so i've shared that then england these teams are uh, already on the academy, by the way, but I've made changes to them. I've changed the players and uh, the kits a little bit. Uh, so, yeah. Um, so now you have these teams available as well, if that's what you're interested in. Share me, copy. So these are all time, by the way. They do have current players as well as legends, but only from Australia, England, Pakistan, and India, you know. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the um, current legends and, uh, you know, current teams um, series, the two series. Is. The next series will be the Quad Nations uh, Cup, which is what this is. It's going to be Australia, England, Pakistan, and India going head to head. These are all time best, um, you know team so now you have those four teams available too if you want to download them and yeah that's pretty much how oh uh someone asked how do you actually do the competition after you have um um downloaded these teams so you go to competition so you back out of that you know you start right here right you start the game right here you've got all the teams and everything now you got to create the league so you go over you go to academy you go to designer you go to competition designer and here you make a new one as you can see see generations trophy quad nations cup lct 10 all of that so you just make a new one give it any name you want i'll just leave it at custom structure if you want a series you can leave it at series but if you want a league then go over to league change match type to whatever you want e10501 day whatever right uh logos you can pick from here if you want custom logos you can just hit rb or r1 and it'll go over to custom logos right whatever logo how many teams do you want for whatever right and then round robins what this means is how many times is each team gonna play each other so if you have four teams and you do leave this at one then each team will play three games since there are three other teams but if you leave this at two then they'll play six games so each team will play the other team twice that's what round robins mean if you want to have playoffs then you can have playoffs how many teams qualify to the finals you can have two or four four means semi-final two means just directly you go to a final eight means quarter final obviously but yeah and then you can select the trophy as you there are so many of them available in the game nice trophies and yeah you can select these settings as well save and donezo right so i'm not gonna save them well actually i did i don't need to because i already have them and then once you've saved that then you go to competition and in competition you go to custom men's or women's it's up to you whichever one you want to do custom men's and you go all the way down and you have these right here so let's just select one of them and here then you hit what did I just do? You hit Y or triangle and you add the teams, right? You add those teams. And uh, what? <laughs> and uh, there you go. Um, and then you just continue and it'll do everything for you. It'll make the schedule and all that. And that's how you do that. So yeah, I hope this was informative. 
If it was, do drop a like, uh, do comment below if you are having any problems. Again, if you have an illegal copy of the game, it will not work. So stop bugging me if you got the game for free. And when I say free, I don't mean like someone gifted it to you. That's, that's okay. <laughs> I mean like you downloaded it from a pirated site, a pirated copy, a cracked version as they say. Um, so yeah, it's not gonna work for that. Anyways, again, I punched the mic, that's all right. You guys have uh, gotten used to it by now, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Drop a like if you did. If you're new, subscribe. Comment below if you're having any problems. And uh, do share the video with others who might need this, you know, tutorial. And uh, yeah, hope I'll see you in the Quad Nations Cup, which will be Pakistan all time, India all time, Australia all time, England all time, going head to head for the big trophy. And then after that, I've got the Generations Trophy. It's a lot of things coming your way, so stay tuned for that.